What is up everybody? This is Journeying Jay, and this video is gonna be a little bit shorter than last time, but today I'm going to take you around the Galesburg Heritage Days Festival, which happens every August around the third weekend. All right, I have arrived at said festival, as you can see from behind me. There are a lot of tents, which usually are either little shops or exhibits. So we're, I'm gonna show you guys around a little bit. take a little bit of a shortcut now to get to the battlefield and the rest of the camp. All right, I made it to the second campsite in the battlefield. Might as well enjoy this homemade root beer now. What you're about to see are clips from a cavalry skirmish reenactment that took place in real life outside of the city of Vicksburg in 1863. The 33rd Division, which is represented here, was actually from and raised in Galesburg and they were extremely crucial in Grant's capturing of the city. Here, uh, they, go, they end up going up against some Mississippi locals who are trying to defend the city. This battle also helps to illustrate the Union Cavalry's uh, gaining superiority over the Confederate Cavalry. On the Federal side, all the horses were trained the same, all the men were trained the same, so if you lost a man and someone else lost the horse, that man could get on that horse and that horse would follow his orders. and a wide range of other things like armor size and several other types of weapons. Solid shot is used primarily 
for breaking apart buildings, breaking apart fortifications, and also long distance shooting. When you're firing into a large body of men, round ball is very effective. You can see men marching in column. Just imagine a round ball, solid round shot. Hitting that column, you would probably kill one in four men rank of that column. I hope you enjoyed your glimpse into the Heritage Days Festival in Galesburg, Illinois. Maybe next year you can come step by too. And also, stay tuned because there could be a bigger, more interesting video project coming soon.